Today, we are using some secret recipes in order to build my girlfriend her dream house inside Minecraft. You guys have seen Michaela play Minecraft before, obviously. She's been in like two videos so far. Now, the problem is the first Minecraft house that Michaela built wasn't exactly magnificent we could say. So I wanna help her out. And in order to do that, I made some pretty significant changes. I wanna show you what we have here. I'm gonna take string and toss it across the top here, put a bucket of water in the center, which will make a lot of sense here momentarily. And then I have five blocks of quartz, which we're just gonna stack around the side. And you can see this gives us a pool in a box, which actually is an egg, but you get the point. I want to build Michaela the best Minecraft house she could ever ask for. And in order to do that, I've created some uh, preset crafting recipes, as you can see, that are going to build into things that she loves. The pool in the box is because Michaela is actually a swimmer. So she's in the pool all the time. So I figured her best Minecraft house is going to have a pool and check this out in three, two, one. Set it down and then use the flint and steel on the TNT underneath, make some space for the egg to grow back up. And we have our pool in a box. And look at this thing. It clears out all the space around and creates an Olympic sized swimming pool underneath. Now, of course, this one is full of squid right now. So I'm gonna have to quickly clear those out because Michaela doesn't like swimming in a pool full of squid. And in order to do that, I've got to run over to this chest here labeled pool supplies. And these aren't your traditional pool supplies, but we'll go ahead and borrow a diamond sword really fast and get in to the water. I gotta be honest, I'm not as comfortable in the water as Michaela is. I'm not the world's best swimmer, so don't judge me as we do this, guys. But I've gotta get Michaela's pool completely clear. Let's jump in and whack some squids. Take them down. Clear out all the squids. Oh, this might take a little bit of time. Please don't ink all over her pool, guys. No, don't mess up all the water. One more, one more, one more. Michaela's pool is secured. Yes, okay, we saved her from the squids. I just gotta clean it up before she sees it. No ink sacs left in the pool. Definitely not good for the chlorine water balance inside the pool, guys. And I've successfully used the pool supplies to clear out the pool. We've got a full Olympic-sized pool here, complete with all the flag markers on either end and a diving board, which you guys comment down below right now. Rate my dive. Jump. Oh, gosh. Oh, okay. Forgive my bad dive. The next thing we're going to craft is actually going to be a way for us to decorate everything as we're building it along the way. Now, big secret about me, guys. I bring Michaela flowers all the time and she loves getting flowers. So what better thing to do than have a mass way for us to quickly just blast flowers all around her new house. In order to do this, we need an iron ingot, we need a piece of TNT, some bone meal, and an oxide daisy on the right-hand side, and that gives us our flower blaster. Now, using this flower blaster, guys, we can run around all around the entire edge of the pool and just shoot flowers in a direction. Watch that I can just shoot it here, and it fires over down there shoot straight ahead into the ground. And we can decorate the whole outside of the pool exactly like this with as many flowers as we want. This flower blaster has unlimited flowers, which is gonna save me a whole awful lot of money. Now, I won't spend too much time doing this because we're gonna have to add some additions as we get the other stuff added to our house. But for now, a couple of flowers here and there, not a bad start. We'll just make sure that we hold on to the flower blaster as we're gonna definitely Definitely need it for more stuff later. Now, this next recipe is my second favorite room in the entire house, and this is going to be a library. We're gonna toss an eye of ender in the center and a lectern at the bottom, surround that by bookshelves and white stained glass across the top, and that's gonna give us our library in a box. The reason I wanna put a library inside this house is because Michaela is a huge fan of classic novels. And I figure what better way to display some classic novels than with a library full of them. Light this one up. It shouldn't damage us, but cross our fingers. And boom. 
our library is formed. Look how tiny I am compared to this massive library. Where's the classic novel section? Quickly, I gotta make sure I know exactly where it is so that I can show Michaela when she comes in to check it out. Come on, classic novel section. Please, 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 classic novel section. Maybe it's up on the top. Yes, we found it, the classic novels. This right here is going to be her favorite section in this entire library, but I've got no doubt she's gonna be able to read everything this library has to offer. Now, what I do want to do is maybe go to the outside here. We're not gonna do this yet, but we're gonna have to connect everything all together, of course. We can't just leave. This thing is so big, guys. We gotta get make sure that this is connected to the pool so that she doesn't have to go outside when she wants to get in between all of the rooms in her house. So I say we put a little hallway right here. But before we commit to anything 100%, let's make sure we get the rest of the rooms in place because my favorite thing is coming up next and we wanna make sure we know exactly how we want things to be laid out. This room we're about to explode into deliciousness right now. I've got a strong feeling is going to be Michaela's favorite room of them all. This is a lab in a box. If you couldn't have been able to tell by the potions that are sitting there, the brewing stand, and all of the glass, Michaela loves chemistry and forensics and everything science. So I got her a whole room dedicated that is going to be a lab room in her house. Her house is actually starting to look way cooler than my house has ever looked. Just got to figure out where we want it to be placed. I say we put the lab on the other side of the swimming pool here, just like like this. This should be good. Get prepared for chemistry. Lab in a box. Here we go. Oh my word. I am so shocked every single time one of these explodes. I mean, look at this. It looks like an official chemistry lab that you would see. Is there anything inside the chest? There is. We have all the chemistry supplies we could ever need inside of these chests right now. Guys, Michaela is going to love this. Comment down below right now what you think Michaela's reaction is going to be before we show her it. I want to see what you guys think. And also, guys, there are loads of you that are not subscribed right now. Make sure if that subscribe button is red, turn that bad boy gray because we're making beautiful, delicious, amazing, flamboyant houses for my girlfriend, Michaela. The only thing I'm concerned about inside this lab is we have a villager trapped. Maybe we're experimenting on him. Maybe something else is going on, but uh, maybe he's caught some sort of disease. We had to quarantine it. I have no idea, but I'm just gonna go ahead and leave that there for Michaela to deal with. She knows lab etiquette way better than I do, so I'm not gonna mess around with the trapped villager. I'm just gonna move on to the next thing, which is going to be designing the hallways between the buildings. And I'm thinking actually for this lower part, because this is just gonna lift up the hallway, we should leave this as a stone floor to be able to support the hallway. Solid construction advice coming from Bahari right now. And this will allow us to connect everything all together with, of course, when we're finished, the jungle transformation or jungle, jungle, jungle planks is what we're gonna use for a beautiful walkway. This is gonna look good, guys. This is gonna look really, really good. And we have got everything connected beautifully. I think you guys are gonna have to be the judge of this. Entering the library, you head up, past the classic novels section and go through the back out the library and you have this hallway with windows out that gold building over there you'll see what that is in just a second this is where you can go down into the pool or I saw this was super cool. The top of the pool looks like an awesome viewing spot. I honestly think Michaela might put some lawn chairs up here. This is a great spot to hang out. And from the outside, you can see all the competition that's happening inside of the pool. But the hallway leads down into the pool deck here where you can get all your training in and all your swimming in, Michaela. Hopefully it's not too bad that you now have no excuse to train because I mean, the pool's literally right there. So you kind of have to train. But running out of the pool over here across the walkway, that is the entrance to the laboratory that she's gonna probably be spending a lot of time in. And around the side, I've added this. And this is for the finale, guys. Up on top here, this is going to be a final victory room. And the way the victory room is going to be set is going to be with her favorite cake of all. Michaela loves German chocolate 
cake. And I have here all the ingredients in German, which I'm not gonna say because I uh, I don't speak German, so I'm gonna pronounce them wrong, but I assume the milch is 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 milk and the, the zucker. Oh, that's probably sugar. That's probably sugar. There's quite a bit of it. There's a little more milk, but there's quite a bit of sugar in the e A, E, and the, and the Weizen. I have no idea what the ingredients are. It's German ingredients, guys. That's besides the point, though. We're going to take the milch, I think the milk, and place it across the top. The E, 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 I is going in the center. On either side, we're placing what I think is the sugar, and then we're going to take the Weizen along the bottom, and that creates our German chocolate cake. Now I'm going to put this in the center of the room here and then I'm going to light the cake on fire and uh that cake turned out a little bigger than expected. Um but she's going to love it. That is a lot of cake. It's got the coconut topping like your traditional German chocolate cake and the cake actually takes up the entire room here. So we're gonna have a lot of eating to do. Let's bring Michaela in and see if she likes her brand new Minecraft house. Okay guys, I've got Michaela here. She's gonna see her house for the first time. She's got her eyes closed right now. Are you ready? Yes. What do you think is gonna be there? <laughs> I don't know. She has no idea what to expect. All right, go ahead, open your eyes. All right, you take control. Chicken. You're gonna, it's behind you is the first room. It's the but entrance to the house. Can I go? No, ignore the chicken, Michaela. The chicken. Uh, no, don't take out the chicken. Why are you taking out the chicken? Okay, go inside. Wait, is this my house? This is the first room. <gasps> it's like Beauty and the Beast. Okay, my so I took gosh. all the rooms and inspired them off of things that you like. So this is your first room and it's a huge library. Okay, so then to the right side is your favorite section in the library. I think up those stairs there and then there's the sign there for your oh yes <laughs> very nice okay so on a one to ten how do you rate the library on a 12 a 12 in the library oh, my word okay so the standard's pretty high the next room that I have for you I think you're gonna love it but you also I don't know it's a little bit more of a physically interactive room Ooh, is this a swimming pool <laughs> listen I've had enough swimming. <laughs> so you don't like it? No, no I do. This is real full cute. Size. I like the little beds. Like this. Very nice. They're the pool, they're pool deck chairs. Can I swim? Yeah, jump in. <laughs> go, 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 go. This is how fast I am in real life. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now the whole pool. Very nice. What do you rate the pool? An eight. Worse than the library? Well, you can't beat the library. Maybe we can. It's Check the third nice. room. <gasps> Ooh. Oh my word, I'm getting chills. <laughs> a library. You have your very and own. And a lab. Uh -huh. Oh my god. And I even have your own test subject in the corner there behind you. Oh, I saw him. I was wondering what Turn he around was. a little more. This one? No, uh, around a little more. There he is. I trapped oh, you a I villager word. that you can test as much Thank as you, you want. That's so sweet of you. <laughs> We and can... inside the chest, if you go to one of the tables, uh -huh. I have all your chemistry supplies in there. That's real sweet. On the far side over there, there's a chest. Okay. No, no, over there. Yeah, go straight ahead. <gasps> Ooh. Okay, okay. What do you rate and press escape and then you'll be able to close out of that menu. Oh okay. Oh gosh. I'd say 10. A 10 for, still doesn't beat the library? I love that library. Okay, the final room. Out of the lab and to the right. This is real cute. But I have a surprise for you once you go inside. Go ahead, open it up and try and guess what it is. How do I open it? Just step onto the plates underneath you and okay. it opens automatically. It's right, it's the thing you're walking around I right know, now. but I don't know what it is. Go jump, jump up on that and see the top of it and look over at it and do a jump and see on the top of it. What is it? It's a massive German chocolate cake. <gasps> It is not. <laughs> oh my word. That gold on top is supposed yeah, to be coconut. Yeah, coconut. <laughs> yep. Mm. Welcome to your new Thank home. Thank you so much. You have to do one thing before you get to What's leave. That? Inside the chest behind you that you walk past, you've got to pick <gasps> your bed color and then you got to place it in the room you want it in. I'm going to put it in my library. Should we we should do pink. And now run back to the go, library. Go, go, go. Okay, so uh, press, uh, I think it's number six, five, and then you're gonna go to the block you want it to place on, one in front of the Ooh, Not like Ooh. that. <laughs> yes! Oh. <laughs> 
We got her bed placed. She wants to stay in the library, guys. Overall, all the rooms put together, what's the rating? Oh, like a 13. A 13? Wait, hold on. Is I that just, even possible? Because it was yeah. a 12 for the library, yeah. an 8 for the pool, and a 10 for the lab. Yeah. I feel like those average down. You should read one of the books to see why it doesn't. 